y'all doing? I want to share with you all that I just went on a mini haul and bought several oils from Jay Bloom. If you've been following me, you know I am a Jay Bloom fan. My first thing that I um, took out the envelope was my facial spray with aloe vera and rose water. Now this, I like to keep this in the refrigerator. Once I wash my face, I like to spray my face with this and it'll get a cool, refreshing feeling once I, um, after spraying this on. I love this stuff. Love it. And then let me see what else. Ooh, yes. This is Melissa. This is out of their luxury line. This comes from their luxury line. This smells so good. Very good. It smells very good. And you know, I use this as a perfume. And it has good uh, healing properties, too. Okay, let me see. And um, let me see what else. Let me see. Cal Here is... Okay, can you see that? Calum... Calamuse, Calamuse. That's okay. I want to make sure. Can y'all see that? Okay. Okay, for everything. Okay, I'm not sure what I'm going to use this for, but I am going to use it, and whatever I use it for, I'm going to let you know. But I heard a lot of good things about this. So, it's in the five mil. Yeah, the five mil. I, I thought this was in a, a, at least a 10 mil bottle, but I guess not. Okay, let me see what else. Oh, yeah. This is a detox, detox uh, the French clay with bentonite clay, uh, clay in it. This is like a... Um, you mix it with a little bit of water, make your little face a uh, face mask. I'm excited to try this. Yes, I am very. Let me move this stuff out the way. I'm excited to try this one. Yeah, and you just add, you know, like a um, like an exfoliation. You, um, I probably do this like twice a week, something like that. Let's see. Oh, let's see what this is. And this. Oh, black pepper. Now, this is good for um, uh, well, circulation. You put this with a carrier oil. If you uh, have, like, um, inflammation, this is good for circulation. And you know what? You can also put this in your food, black pepper. Uh, oh, parsley seed. This is another one that you can put in food. But this is another good one Um, that's... Uh, that is good for circulation and different and other different um, aromatherapies that you can use. But I'll let you know what I use it for because I'm gonna be doing a lot of DIYs as well. Ooh, you can't go wrong with grapefruit, y'all. Pink grapefruit, and I think I have this. I'm not sure, I think I have this. But anyway, uh, I'm most definitely gonna be cleaning with this one. Do a lot of cleaning with this grapefruit. I love cleaning with citrus, with citrus oils. Let me see. And then this one, oh, it's cor coriander seed. Uh huh. Non GMO, therapeutic. I love J. Bloom oils. I really do. And they don't, um, it's not an MLM. And you know, they, they're not expensive. You know what I'm saying? It's just, they don't, they don't, uh, they just not expensive. It's not an MLM. The, uh, you know how to, to like uh, do do Terra or um, Young Living. It's not like that at all. As a matter of fact, um, you and they always giving up stuff away free. Always, always. I mean, all you have to do is spend five dollars or more, and you get free shipping with ten dollars. I mean, you just can't beat the stuff they do, and they always having good sales. I mean, they just they just. I mean, you just can't beat Jay Bloom. And, and as you see on the bottles, non-GMO, therapeutic grade, just like Young Living and Duterra, it's all the same, except they're not as uh, expensive as um, Duterra and Young Living and the other uh, companies out there. And they sell a lot of different variety of different oils that you've never seen before. Like this is cumin. Uh, let me 
see. And oh, this is dill seed. Now, you know, I, anybody that knows me know I love making um, homemade pickles. So I'm going to try to put some of this in there. And it smells just like dill. <laughs> but I'm going to put some of this in there. And this is, hmm. Not sure what I'm going to use this for yet. I got to do some more research. Research on this one. But see where, see where it say non-GMO non still steam distilled therapeutic grade. Uh, I think this is named Thuja. 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 Something like that. And this kind of remind me of um, a pine. This kind of remind me of pine. But I probably end up diffusing this one with another um, oil around the Christmas time. And let me see. Oh, chili seed. Chili seed is another one good. Another one, y'all, for uh, good for circulation. It's a hot oil. It's good for circulation and um, inflammation. And also good, you can use this as cooking. We're cooking. Make you some chili. You can add this in there. Sure can. Let me see. Uh-oh, here we go. This is out of their luxury line. This is saddlewood. Yes. And here's another one. Uh, ooh, here's another one, y'all. Anybody that's into oils know about this one. That's another that's another luxury oil. Well see this they just came out with this. This they sensitive line. And um like this, I think this bottle a bottle of pure oil of this is I think it's like forty five between forty five and fifty two dollars just for the five mil. And so this is already this already come diluted, pre diluted. See, it comes with a fractionated coconut oil, and it's and they and it's like ten percent of the uh, of the oil, and the rest is um, fractionated coconut oil, and all of them, and all that sensitive lines. And oh, and this right here is good for acne, real good for acne, smooth. I can't wait to try that one. Let me see what else I have. Ooh, green mandarin. Green mandarin. Can y'all see that? There you go. Green mandarin. That's another one I would uh I was shocked to see that it came in a five mil. But any like I say, anything citrus, I'm gonna move these out the way. Anything citrus, I like to clean with it or diffuse it. And let me see. Oh, ginger grass. A lot of good stuff I can do with this one. Let me focus that. A lot of good stuff I can do with this one. Yes. Most definitely going to be diffusing this one. Okay, now let's see here. Let me move this back some. Citronella. Y'all already know. You already know what citronella is all about. The mosquitoes. Make you up a spray when you go out. Put that in a little spray bottle with some water. Just spray yourself down. Keep the mosquitoes at bay. And let me see, what is this one? Palomarosa. Let me see, I don't want to knock nothing over. Palomarosa. This is another one I have to do some research on. But I'm sure they got some real good properties, good uh, healing properties in it. So, um, I'll let you know. I will most definitely let you know on that one. There's no way once you start collecting oils, you can just get one or two. There's, I mean, it, no, there's no way you can just do that. Not for me anyway. I just want, I heard a lot of good stuff about this. I'm going to do some more research on this one and let you all know. I heard some good stuff about this one. But I want to read and research for myself. I don't go about what somebody tell me. Uh, let me see. See how I'm with it. This is another one. That will need the, uh, I heard about a lot of good stuff. Let me focus that. Can you see? There you go. See how I would. I wanted, that's another one I want to do some research. I heard a lot of good stuff about it, but let me research and then I'll let you all know. And I 
have another small envelope. I've never seen the envelopes this small. This is the free oil. This right here is a free oil, y'all. Frankincense. Now, anybody that knows me know that this is my favorite oil. I love frankincense. All of them. It's three types of frankincense. J. Blue only sells two of them. And I'm trying to get them to sell the third one. But I love frankincense, period. All of them. All of them. I do. It's good for uh, pain. Cramps. All that. Any type of pain is good for it. Let me see. Ooh, y'all. And here is Rose. Rose Absolute. This is also called the Rose of Sharon. And it's also called the Rock Rose. If anybody know anything about this, this is in the Bible. Um, uh, this is a biblical oil. And it's also out of a luxury sensitive line. And like I said, it's 10% of Rose Absolute. I think this bottle of pure oil or pure Rose Absolute oil, I think it's like $68 for a 5 mil which is still good. If you do some research, you'll see that that um, that the Rock of Rose, Rose Absolute, or the um, Rose of Sharon. And I think it has another name, too, that uh, that this oil go by. And I'm not sure what it is, but I do know for sure the Rose of Sharon, Rock of Rose, and then the Rose Absolute. Uh, you'll see this, this that oil is up in the two and $300 and more. But they sell theirs for 68 But if you buy this one, I think this was $17, which is not bad, y'all, at all. And like I said, it's 10% oil, and the rest of it is uh, fractionated coconut oil. Let me double check. Yep, fractionated coconut oil, and the rest of it is 10% um, of oils. So you can't beat that. Let's see. Oh, let me show you this. Now, I wanted to try their new tooth, the toothbrushes. It's all plant-based bamboo toothbrush. It's all uh, all components, bristles, handle, wrapper, and box are made from plants. This is all natural. Um, and I want to try this, and I'll let you know how I like it. Oh, I'll, I'll let you know how I like it. Let me take it out the box. Oh, this is a little fancy, snazzy little toothbrush made out of bamboo. All right now, brush with bamboo. Yeah. I'm going to let you know how I like this. Because I'm all about natural. I'm trying to get away from all that other stuff as much as I can. You can't get totally away from it, but you can do some to try to eliminate some of it. But anyway, I want to say thank you for watching and namaste.